New foes appear in Action Comics issue 967. So as well as beginning a new Men of Steel storyline, Action Comics issue 967 also continues the storyline with the mysterious disappearance of the Genetocron building, which Clark and John find in the middle of the Amazon, along with Doomsday Cell and two pods which actually look strangely like Kryptonian birthing matrixes. The issue also introduced us to the villains of this storyline which have been teased throughout the last couple of issues of Action Comics, and the villains are the God Slayer and his lackey Zaid, who come after Lex Luthor because of his ties with Apocalypse and his armor working with boom tubes and whatnot, as well as his destiny to take Darkseid's place on the war planet. It's because of this that the God Slayer wants to kill Luthor in order to save Earth from another attack by Apocalypse, which is kind of hinted at at the start of this issue, where we see a, I believe, a flash forward to uh, the Earth being laid to waste by Apocalypse's forces and I think they're trying to do a sort of twist here and I think that person that we see come through the boom tube is actually going to be Clark. I think they're gonna maybe do the storyline uh, legacy like what they did within the animated series where he was raised by Darkseid and became Darkseid's son kind of. I think they're gonna do a sort of bait and switch. Obviously this will lead to Superman teaming up with Lex for this storyline maybe so it will in turn lead to some really cool interaction with them and I can't wait to see what they say with each other and say and do uh, well interacting with each other. We also get an answer to why Superman isn't wearing his classic costume. Uh, we find out that obviously he wore the black one because he was working in the shadows and trying to keep low profile and he didn't want to wear the classic costume because he wanted to go with something that was a bit more like his new 52 counterparts as to ease the transition in the eyes of the people of the world. I think it's a pretty cool reason reason why he isn't in the old costume and I like they even make like a joke about the briefs and how they're not actually briefs they're actually just something that's on the costume they're actually part of the costume they're not don't sit as briefs I thought that was actually pretty cool because a lot of people seem to think they are kind of trunks and they kind of like they look like them and I understand why people can get confused but yeah it's cool that we got an explanation that they're actually not this story looks set to be a big one and I can't wait to see what happens in it I'm going to give this issue a nice out of 10. Hey everyone, thanks so much for watching my latest video, hope you enjoyed it. While you're here, why not check out another one of my reviews, like and subscribe my channel for more reviews and videos, and follow me on Twitter at Matt underscore FOS. Thanks guys, and I will see you all next time.